ओके गुड मॉर्निंग एवरी वन टूडे वी आर मूविंग टूवर्ड्स द एक्सपेरिमेंट दैट इज द सैम्पलिंग एंड रिकन्स्ट्रक्शन ओके आई थिंक यू सीन द दी हेर इज द किट सैम्पलिंग एंड रिकन्स्ट्रक्शन किट द किट देर इज द दिस पोर्शन इट इज द नैचुरल सैम्पलिंग पार्ट ओके एंड हेर इज द फ्लैट टॉप सैम्पलिंग पार्ट एंड दिस इज द डॉटेड ब्लॉक विल बी गिवन दैट इज द रिसीवर साइड एंड here only one block is given that is the low pass filter that is the demodulated block here it will be blocks the high pass filter and it will be gives the it attenuates the low frequency and we gets the original signal okay means in this kit actual three parts that is the natural sampling flat top sampling and that dot dotted part that is the receiver side and that receiver uh, output it will be given as an input for the low pass filter and we'll gets the original signal okay but in detail what is the sampling and reconstruction there is actual basically continuous signal is converted in discrete signal okay and there is actual basic two types that is the first one is the ideal and second one is the practical what is ideal sampling there is ideal sampling is carrier having no width hence it will be moving towards the pra practical sampling in practical sampling that is the this one part natural sampling and another one is the flat top sampling okay in natural sampling there is a sampled output will be varying accordance with modulating signal okay now we will move towards the our actual practical okay here is the given crystal uh, block that is the crystal clock that will be generates the carrier signal and carrier signal is nothing but the high frequency here is the given frequency divider that is the block it will be generates the modulated signal it having the low frequency and it will that two frequency it will be adding with each other okay initially we will start the connection that frequency divider block it will be given as an input of the natural sampling okay that is the first input second input that is the crystal clock that is the nothing but carrier signal it having the high frequency it will be given to the clock means it will be control that and that control output that is the a it will be given as an input second input of the natural sampling and will gets the that is the output of natural sampling but it is the only process of the only natural sampling then we will that output it will be given as an receiver purpose that is the as an input okay but here another one block is the given that is the hold pulse that is the hold pulse block is will be converting the pulse strain into pulse okay that will be taken from the controlled output that is the ap okay now here is the given three points that is the c1 c2 and another one that is the receiver input you have to short this any one from one okay and then we will takes the receiver out and that receiver output will gets the here we complete the demodulation process but we will gets the distortion waves means something noise will be creates okay and now we have to remove that noise and distortion hence we that pin will be connected to the low pass filter means it will be block the high pass frequency and it will be attenuates the low frequency newly gets actual original signal from this output okay and here is the another one pin that is the basically it requires in each circuit that is the ground pin okay now we we'll see the output step wise out okay initially we connected the ground pin now we will move towards the dso we will check the outputs details output okay will we start the our okay now we will start the check the outputs in detail step wise that is the first one our original signal that is the base signal that is the 
we get the we are having the low frequency that is the modulated signal in dsl we getting that sinusoidal wave okay now then we will check the crystal clock signal that is the nothing but carrier signal it having the this signal okay this signal will gets the that is the high frequency carrier signal okay then we check the control signal already we see in the ppm experiment such type of signal we gets the that is the pulse pulse type signal okay then that signal will be given to the as an input of the natural sampling we will see the output of natural sampling that is the before of demodulation process we seen that is the such type of signal that is the already we seen in pam experiment okay that is the our actual output okay but it is the not a demodulated output hence we will move towards the demodulated process okay now we will see the receiver signal it is the receiver signal that is the staircase staircase type signal we see here then now we have to remove that noise and distortion by using of low pass filter it will be blocks the high frequency signal and we gets the original signal and that is the our final output signal will seen from the here that is the low pass filter block that is the our last block and we gets the original signal and that is the our output of this experiment that is the natural sampling experiment okay thank you